Thank you, Ben. Thank you. All right, I promised you kitchen essentials. That's what we're gonna do this hour. So these are the very innovative ideas that are gonna make your life easier when it comes to the work that we have to do in the kitchen. But I wanna give you a little preview of something coming up toward the end of the hour. This is from Blackstone. It is a portable outdoor gas griddle. Yeah, cooking griddle style, meaning you have actually got 339 square inches of beautiful controlled heat. You've got dual controls here. You can do everything from your burgers to your breakfast, to your fish, your steaks, all of it. It's a huge heavy duty, heavy duty, easy for me to say, cooking surface. And you can take it anywhere because it just runs with a propane tank. So Mark Gill is here and we will be cooking up some amazing food. You're really gonna wanna stick around for that to see how versatile this is. It's on free shipping and handling right now as well and available on five flex payments. So that is coming up. Um, over 100 perfect five-star reviews on that one, by the way. So if you want to get it, you'll have to wait to see it. Okay, so we're going to move on now to prep work. That's like the hardest, most tedious part of cooking, right? And Kelly Diedring is here. She's one of our kitchen experts Hi. here at HSN to show us from Dash the mini chopper. So no more giant yes. food processor when you just need enough for like a family of four. Okay, most of us are easy. running our own catering company. Right. Let's be honest. We don't need the little like 11, 12, 13 cup food processor. This does it all though. This, a smaller this is a food processor, a mini chopper. You can see the price is kind of amazing. I love the size of it. It's two full cups, but let me show you the power that you're going to get. Okay. We're going to do some prep work, but then we're going to show you that it is a true food processor. We're going to do cashew butter. We're going to do some oh. pesto. We're going to do homemade um, sorbets. So it's your prepper and your food processor. A lot of people get it because they love the size. Mm -hmm. They love the name brand, but we're going to put the hardest vegetable known to man, okay. right? This is tough. You would never get out a knife and chop, chop, chop all these carrots, Especially right? Especially not the baby ones. Especially not the baby Ooh. ones. Or maybe the cauliflower rice you want to do. Or maybe it's your garlic. You want to have fresh garlic. You have two functions on this, so I love that it's easy to use. You can pulse. Okay. So maybe I would like a coarse chop on my carrots. Maybe I'm making a beautiful soup or a stew and I want to stop there. Mm -hmm. Or maybe I want to do a fine chop. Look at that. Couple of seconds, you can see the results. That was about 20 seconds. That was really. about not, probably not even. Oops. If we were, look at <laughs> Start this. Start to finish. So results of your fine chop wow. on your carrots. So maybe you're doing food prepping for the week and you're doing Monday through Friday, all your healthy meals. You can get everything prepped and put into your little boxes, you know, right. on a Sunday afternoon in a matter of seconds and without not, getting out a knife. Yeah, the knife, the yep. cutting board, the huge food processor that you only need a little bit. I love, it's a smaller size. You still get it's a two cup capacity and then yep. there are cute little colors, which we, we love, love dash for that. that. Yep Jinx that was amazing <laughs> We love dash for that. Okay, we do love dash red. For that. This one is going to be is this just silver stainless? Oh, we're calling that black. black. Okay, because yep. the trim is black. Sure. So there's red, there's black, and then this is the a beautiful aqua. aqua, which is so cute. Um, okay, so now I just what did are we my doing? carrots. And beforehand, I did some peppers. You can see down on my plate, I did my cauliflower rice, but onions. Oh, yeah. If you never want to um, cry from chopping onions again, you know, most of us don't love to get out the knife, the cutting board, right. you know, having all the tears. Then your hands smell of onions for the rest Forever, of the day. Yeah. Let's be honest. You can give it a pulse. Maybe I don't have it all the way on, right? Let's try that again. No, oh, let's see. Did we accidentally unplug it We lost it down power, here? I think. I think we might have lost power. <laughs> Try it one more time. I Good think. times. Nope, I think we lost okay. power on that one. Well, let's move on. Yeah, we'll move on. We will We will come back to that one. Um, but, you know, just as you can see in this video, okay, there's the onions. Perfect. Exactly what it's going to do if we hadn't lost power. It's chopping. It's mincing. It's dicing. If salsa. you want, Yeah, we're going to do a salsa. If you want a coarse chop, you can get a coarse chop. Okay. If you want a fine chop, you have control without getting out a knife, without getting out a cutting board. At the end of the day, it's that little miniature food processor. So you don't have these big, clunky, cumbersome right. machines, right? So easy. And the it's price simple. is great. Right on this. So this is normally $50. I just want to let you know, $15 off right now. So $34.95, free shipping and three flex payments. So you can break that up into equal interest-free monthly payments. Yep. So you just put in some oil. So a little bit of oil. We have our cashews. And then I want to show you this feature. This is a feature of the really high-end food processors. Okay. It will actually fold in your oils, your waters, your creams. Look as it's drizzling it in nicely and slowly through the top. There's little holes in the top there. So I'm just folding in a little bit of oil. Oil. But whatever you want to fold in, normally you do it while it was running, but okay. you know it's, it's loud for me to talk sure. and do it. So I'm just showing you that. And then when I hit that chop button, 
It's gonna make a beautiful cashew butter, but maybe those were peanuts and you wanna do a peanut butter. Uh -huh. Maybe those were almonds and you wanna do an almond butter. It's totally up to you. You now can control your ingredients, right? If you've ever, you know, turn the uh, jar of peanut butter around, yeah, are you mortified by the amount of, a lot of chemicals, preservatives? Extras. I just spent like $14 on a little bar or jar of almond butter. $14, but that expensive. doesn't surprise me. <laughs> it's incredibly it. expensive. You know, you're gonna spend a couple of dollars on the cashews. The oil is the oil of your choice. So maybe you like coconut oil or canola oil, it's up to you. But now you control the ingredients, right? You know exactly what's in your food. And that's why Dash's motto is unprocess your food, right? Get the preservatives, get the extra sodium, get the chemicals out of our food so that we can eat healthier, but we don't have to work harder. Look at the cashew butter that we just created. Going in for that. Can you imagine that's maybe amazing. putting those in little glass jars and gifting it away for whatever holiday or to all the teachers? Mm -hmm. It's now like you've become that Pinterest mom mm -hmm. that makes all these homemade foods, but you have this tiny little food processor that does it in the blink of an eye. There's so much flavor in that for having two ingredients. That's amazing. Two ingredients, no chemicals, no added sodium, no added colors. Mm -hmm. Oh my goodness, they add food coloring to everything nowadays. Yeah. Even yeah. stuff that you would think doesn't need food coloring. Um, so I love this one too, because I like to do a fresh pesto. Ooh, and so in there. this is just basil, but this could also be like arugula mm -hmm. or peas. I know there's a pea pesto. You have um, uh, pine nuts and then we have our Parmesan yeah. and then of course a little oil. And remember, if you're just joining us, you have that pour spout at the top. All you do is fold in your oil. Maybe it's a little cream. Maybe it's whatever melted butter. Whatever you're making, you can fold it in slowly. And then you have two functions. I always give everything a pulse <laughs> to get things going. Okay. And then I give it that full charge. And that full charge basically turns it in to a little mini blender, right? I mean, you can see the power of this machine and, and let's anything, go in. And you come off as a way better cook. Oh, just yeah. Just because everything tastes fresh. You Absolutely. really get the, the flavor and the aromas out of your food. And look at our fresh pesto, right? Looks different Yum. than the jars of pesto, because guess what? All the ingredients are whole, they're fresh, they're real. You can pronounce them, right? There's no That's chemicals. Great. There's no added green food coloring yeah. or added sodium, or so, maybe you're sugar-free. There's no added sugar. So when you're done, how are you cleaning this thing up? So everything obviously, except the motor, okay. dishwasher safe. Oh, nice. I just take mine because I use it all the time and rinse it because I don't want Perfect. it stuck in the dishwasher when I yeah. need it, but it's dishwasher safe. Yep. And then you could just leave it on the counter because this is a cute little guy. It's only 10 inches high. Yeah. But the Two capacity, cups. Two full cups. How many people is that, would you say? If you're I mean, like, I would prepping. say a family of one to four. Perfect. Yeah, maybe six. So Depends on how much prep work. The thing. Yeah, most yeah. of you, absolutely. Frozen berries. This is kind of an interesting recipe. It's a quarter cup of lemon juice, a quarter cup of cream. But it could be a quarter cup of coconut milk or if you're dairy free, soy milk, whatever you want to do. And then I always start to pulse everything. And then you just keep going. And then I just go. Look how pretty that is. And you can see I'm making a sorbet. A dessert that's guilt-free. Literally, frozen blueberries, right. guilt-free. You know, a little bit of cream, not so much guilt. It's a real food, right? And then lemon juice to give it that little extra kick. I'm dying to try this one. Okay, you have to try it. And look <laughs> at, but look at the consistency. Would you ever think you could throw frozen fruit in a machine like this? No, I mean. And I, that's why we love Dash. There's so many reasons you may want this. Maybe you want to try something new, do something different, eat healthier. Maybe you just want it for the convenience factor sure. to not have to Size, sit there and chop. Yep. And yes. I love that it comes with recipes. You actually get recipes for artichoke dip, the walnut pesto, almond butter, sliders, turkey sliders, peanut Yeah, there's hummus. a burger recipe in there Never to do your meatloaf, that, your mixtures. guacamole, a bacon burger. All right, girl, you gotta try this. I have to try this. Okay, I'm gonna I'm do so a little lemon zest on the top to be fancy. You know, Valentine's so Day is coming up. Maybe you're making this for your significant other. All that is is a little lemon zest and a mint, but you tell me oh if that's guilt-free, if that's worth it. If you're doing like the low carb, low sugar, low you know gluten, whatever, allergy you might have, you might not be able to find those things mm -hmm. in the grocery store. Is it kind of amazing? Wow, the it's lemon good. is amazing in that too. Yeah. Look at the consistency of this though. It's a I sorbet. Mean, legitimate sorbet. <laughs> so you would you think really... you would need wow. a five or 600 watt blender, wouldn't you? Look at that, no. That's really, really good. Yep, that's okay, why I love Okay, so dash. we've done cashew butter, pesto. Yep. We've got the a sorbet. And okay, now, now what are we doing? Well, we have Super Bowl coming up, mm -hmm. right? I'm hoping this gets you by Super Bowl. You're gonna love it. Big game, excuse me. The big, big game. game. Yep. Yes. Yeah, we'll All right, watching. so we have five ingredients. We have tomato, we have onion, we have cilantro, we have a little bit of lemon juice, and of course, we got a little jalapeno in there. You could skip that, depending on your tastes. I always pulse everything just to get it going, and then depends on the style of um, salsa that you like. If you like a chunky salsa, you could just pulse it. 
I like that sort of restaurant mm -hmm. style, that little bit of a creamier salsa. That was maybe 10 seconds, right? If you turn the jar of salsa that you typically buy around, the chemicals, the I'm preservatives. Nervous, look. Yeah, I don't okay, know. with your fresh cilantro, with your fresh jalapeno, with your fresh tomato, there's nothing better than homemade salsa for the big game or for any time. I'm coming. I mean, go. sometimes I'll have chips and salsa as, a, as my meal. You know, I love some chips and salsa, that's but that's really fresh. Easy. Wow. Yeah, that fresh salsa, nothing beats that fresh salsa. So think about everything you love about using a food processor and yep. a chopper, but then take away the cumbersome big size of it, having to clean it up, right. dig or it out. Or the 20 different blades they come with. It's crazy. Yeah, they this come with 20 more. different blades. This yep. is the perfect little size. And it's $34. It's free shipping. Yep. Why not try it? You still have 30 days to try everything here at HSN. Look at See, that. It makes salad. your life easier. That All right. Well, so for quick. those of you that are doing meal prepping or maybe you're doing the keto, you can see I just had my ingredients for my egg salad, which is just eggs, mm -hmm. a little mustard, a little mayo. We had some dill relish in I was here. I ask if you did pickles. Yeah, we did a little dill yeah. relish. And that's up to you. But look at how beautiful and chopped and perfect that egg salad is. And then let's say I want to freeze it. Egg salad. It's great to be frozen. You really? can freeze it for the next week. You can just make yourself all these foods and freeze them and stay healthy. So and you're gonna love wow. having the size, the capacity, the ease of use, ease to clean. And it's super cute. It's super cute. And that's why it's part of our Kitchen Essentials show because look at all the wide range of things that you can make. Yeah. Kelly, thank you. We all didn't right. even get to the hummus. I know, we hummus and yeah, we're gonna make all kinds of stuff, but so I'll save it for things. you. Sounds good all to right. me. We'll see. There <laughs> won't be any left. They, it, once it goes in the hallway, it's gone. It, it's a lie. It's, it's gone. <laughs> all right, so we're gonna move on now to talk talking about ice, right? I know, I know, it's cold outside, but listen, you still put ice in your drink, don't you? And how about a way to get ice that's ready in about seven minutes, that tastes cleaner, that's fresher, that is always there, you don't have to run out to the store to get it, and it doesn't get stuck as a big giant block in the door of your freezer, right? This is the one you're gonna wanna pick up from improvements. This is the compact stainless steel ice maker. It's actually the smallest footprint of the ice makers that we offer, the lightest weight, but the same capacity you're looking at 26 pounds of ice in a one day period. Is that the craziest thing ever? And you don't have to hook it up to a water line. Plug it in, fill it up, and you're good to go. We have beautiful colors available for you. This one is the purple. Just want you to see to the difference here between purple and blue. Blue has like a purpley undertone to it, almost like a blueberry, okay? Next to that one, this is actually called black. I love the look of this. It's like a graphite look. If you have stainless steel appliances, you'll love the black. 50 left if you want that one, not surprised. Next to that is copper. This would look so pretty at your bar. And next to that one is red. Normally this is $159.95, so we took $30 off. Free shipping and handling today, and it's on a flex payment of $25.99. And Rebecca Wood is here. Here. an oh. expert when it comes to all things home, but you personally love this. love this as well. And I know so many people here at HSN do too. You always need ice. Everybody oh. talks about the ice maker. Yeah. I love that. And you said all things home. And the great thing about the ice maker is it goes out of your home too. It's true. Whether it's tailgating, days at the cabin, on the boat, whether you just want to take it down to your condo if you're a snowbird, all you need is a standard outlet. That's yeah. it, a standard outlet. And this little beautiful guy right here, if you can believe it, will make all of this ice in 24 hours. That's 26 amazing. pounds of ice. That's amazing. You know how it works? Because it churns out a whole tray of ice every seven minutes. So it's a very special way that this happens, yes. right? And there's there's very good reason for it. So here's some video for you. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna take it out of the box and plug it in. If you have a standard outlet of water, you're set. You put that water right into the reservoir. It holds about a gallon of water. You push on and then you make your selections. Do you want large ice or do you want small ice? And then that's it. It Look, continues to make it ice. Look at that every single time. It almost, I liken it to um, playing playing jack, was that, slots? Every time you hear it, you're like, there it goes, there it goes. <laughs> Cha -ching. But do you see what your choices are? You can decide between the large, which is gonna be perfect for your mixed drinks, your lemonades, your Long Island iced teas. That small though, that's gonna grind to a creamy consistency. Yeah, so your creamy. protein, creamy. Yeah. I'm gonna make you a shake coming up. But whether it's a protein shake, whether it's your pina coladas, your margaritas, it really does grind to a creamy consistency. So Rebecca, once it turns out the ice and it's here, do I store it here or you take it out? Oh, that's such a great question. Yeah. No, remember, this is an ice maker, not an ice keeper. So when you can see when this tray is full and there's actually a little indicator light that will tell you when it's full, uh -huh. you're just going to take it and then take, remove the 
just like that. Okay. And put your ice into a nice keeper, whether it's a chest, whether it's into the freezer, anything like and that. And then it can just keep going. And then it just keeps yeah. making it, you know what that means? More time for you to go and enjoy <laughs> the party and not babysit. It even comes with a little scoop. So if you have this continuously making ice, you're at a party, you can leave the scoop here and people can grab right from the well, um, tray. I love this one too because this is the most compact version that we offer, it is. yet it's still the same capacity that it's turning out for you. So this is great if you're tight on space or you know you're gonna be taking it out and exactly. about since you don't have to hook it up to any kind of water line. So if you're new yeah. to improvements, what we do at improvements is we approve, improve upon problems we all have. I mean, come on, have you, do you know of a person that hasn't heard the words, honey, we're out of ice? Yes. We've all had that problem. Improvements knows that. So they go and they fix those problem solutions. But not only do we improve that, we improve on our own products. So this is the lightest, most compact ice maker we've ever made. It's smaller and about four pounds lighter, 18 and a half pounds. So that means when your friend's having the party, instead of what can I bring, you can say, guess what? I'm gonna take ice completely yeah. off your shoulders. Right. I'm gonna bring my ice maker, you plug it in, and in seven minutes, Minutes, you're gonna get a full tray of ice. Because what's the alternative, right? Maybe you have the ice maker in the fridge. That thing is always clogged or broken, or maybe you don't have one. I don't have one in my fridge, Mine right? Mine broken three times, and I've actually tried to stuff my hand up there because you can hear it's clogged. Can't do that, Can't not do a that. good idea. Or maybe you use these ice trays that are such a pain, they take forever. You can I hear it here, can you hear the ice maker right there? It's but coming out. I think the beauty of this too is it's all self-contained, so you're not taking on everything else in the freezer. Have you exactly. ever had a drink and it stinks? a little bit. That's why not only is this going to be the fastest ice that you've ever had, this will be the best tasting ice you've ever had because it's all made in this one self-contained unit and it's flash frozen, meaning less impurities trapped. So not only are you not picking up with this guy, this takes did you have six, six hours they for 24 ice cubes? Yeah, and I they break and they never, and they taste funky. And not you only, only get like 12. 20, yeah, 12? 24, I think. Oh, 24. <laughs> See, I, <laughs> I think really it's 24. Like, <laughs> we just buy ice. We're constantly we do because buying you don't want to deal do. with these. Yeah. That's why the ice maker, a lot of times if you're dealing with this, it's in a condo, it's in a boat, right. it's at a cabin. Maybe it's your summer home. Summer or, home. Well, guess you what? You can take this candy with you. This with you. you. Holy yeah. moly, as long as you have a plug. I just want to say. They're all going right now. If you want the black, I, how many do we have? 40, 40 left if you want to pick up this black. I think it's really popular because it's a beautiful graphite it's kind like of color. It's like a gunmetal, isn't it beautiful? Yes, it's really pretty. Hematite. So just to keep you posted on that, but we do have lots of color options for you. So, I mean, have some fun with this. Even yes. if you're leaving it out, if you're not, if it's just for parties, whatever the case is, they're gorgeous. And look, look how like sleek jewels. it looks up there with your you know, entertaining station. Not only is it the lightest, it's the smallest footprint. So you will keep this on your countertop. You are going to enjoy this the day of. In fact, I'm gonna make you that, that smoothie right okay. now because you're gonna wake up in the morning and you're gonna turn on your ice maker. In seven minutes, you're gonna have a full tray of ice. You're gonna take that ice and watch what I'm just putting in here because it, my girlfriends made so much fun of me because I was saying, this makes creamy ice. Yeah. And they said, that's not possible. How do you make creamy ice? And then I made them a drink and they couldn't believe it. So you see I'm putting some ice in there, okay. some of your favorite frozen fruit and we're gonna put some juice. That's it, you see that? If you wanted to, you could put a protein smoothie, uh -huh. uh, any kind of a no dairy. powder. No dairy. Now I'm gonna turn this dash on. So what would that be? Look, you can tell. Would that be seven minutes and 10 seconds? That was so fast. <laughs> seven minutes and 10 seconds. And when I pour this in here, it's going to look almost like a sorbet, like an ice cream. It's absolutely delicious. My husband has, there's one restaurant where he likes the ice. He legitimately is like, I want to find an ice maker that makes that ice for the same reason. It's a creamy taste to it. The it consistency does. is totally different and it's clean tasting. If you like your cocktails as well, um, if you like to have like your, your whiskeys over ice and you don't want to get the taste of everything else in the freezer, in the drink, this is a smart way to go too. But a smoothie a at smoothie, its simplest. Just like this. So if your New Year's resolution was to eat healthier, drink healthier, drink more water. I drink more water because all I'm tasting now is the water, not what I had for dinner last mm. night, not garlic and onion. I'm just tasting fresh, crisp water. It tastes like a creamsicle. Oh, exactly. That is does. a, yes, like a creamsicle. So can you walk us through how we're gonna do this? Yeah, when we get sure. home? Do we need special water? Does it matter? No, you what don't. Do do? And remember, it's portable. It's about 18 and a half pounds. Mm. You can take it wherever you wanna go. But when it comes to you, you're just gonna take it out of the box and plug it in. You get about a six foot cord and then 
You pretend there's no ice in there, you're just gonna take out the tray right here, and this is the reservoir where you're gonna pour the water in, and it will hold about a gallon of water. That's a lot of ice it's going to make. You fill that up to the fill line, replace the tray, and then you just hit the on button. It's that simple. That's it. If you want small, hit the select button to the S. If you would like the large ice, hit the select button to the L. Wow. It will even tell you when the when to add water. Again, you're not hooking this up no. to a water line. No That's water line or drain. This. Take it everywhere. In fact, the only when we say no drain, there's a little drain on the bottom that you just pull out. Just so like the, a cooler. That's when the you... only maintenance there is. You're wow. going to find if you at the end of the party if there's a little water left over, you find a sink or if it's outside, it can be over the ground. You unplug that plug, you just pull it out. And that's it. This that is, is a good it. opportunity to show you guys the colors as well um, because this is purple and right next to that is blue. So just so you can tell there's a little of a purpley undertone with the blue, but it's it's definitely uh, a difference. You can see the Yes, difference. you can see this is a brighter purple. But when you get it home, just know there are definitely purple yeah. undertones. Black, less than 20 now. This one is going to go if you want the black. This is like a full-on graphite look. It's so sleek and pretty. Copper is the second most limited behind the black. If you want to pick this up as copper. And then the beautiful, beautiful beautiful red. What a great gift idea as well for somebody, especially someone who likes to entertain. Maybe they travel a lot. So they've got vacation homes, boats. Right. Again, all you need is a power outlet and water to pour in. I think we all know good. the consummate entertainer, the person that's always yeah. hosting the parties. This would be such a great gift to give them or just to always bring it with you to and those parties. it could parties. be every day because this is the most compact unit we offer with the same exact capacity, yes. which is amazing. So it's only 12 and 3 quarter inches high, just that's to give you it. an idea. Fit right on your that's countertop like easily takes yeah. a small footprint for 26 pounds of ice. So we're talking about the entertaining, but we're also talking about your boating weekends. We're talking about all of those weekends at the ball field. You parents are amazing. You sit there all weekend long. I was able to make ice in the back of my car when the hurricane hit because you just need the wow. adapter. Remember, oh, yeah. just all plug it in. You, that's yeah. all you need is a plug-in. And I got the adapter. I was able to make ice right out of the back of my car. Okay, 10 left in black. I feel like this is like the final countdown. Final <laughs> 10 <laughs> left if you want to pick up the black. I just want to keep you posted. Pick it up. I mean, it's $30 off. It's free shipping and handling right now. And we have five flex payments available. So $25.99 and we will send it to you right away on us with that free shipping and you can get started plug it in put the water in seven minutes boom you've got the freshest cleanest tasting ice which sounds so weird to say but there is a big difference between that and what's sitting in the freezer Such next to huge. like the frozen veggies because know? nothing's transferring to the ice first of all it's flash frozen so less impurities but it's all made in this one self-contained unit so it's not picking up whatever you're having in the refrigerator hooked to your um, freezer it's not picking up what you had for dinner last night. Yeah. I always, always taste onion and garlic in my water. Oh. And so I just didn't drink water. And now I'm able to just taste the water and it tastes so much better and I'm able to have it. So we're talking about all of your get togethers. You're gonna love this just as much in December for your all of your big holidays as you are in July for those long summer nights where you're drinking maybe a Long Island iced tea and daily, that every day in between. You can see we have the tea, we have the water. My personal favorite way to use this in the morning. It's coffee. It's coffee. Yes. Do you want this? I can make this I for do. you too. <laughs> so I, I am an iced coffee fanatic. I love iced coffee, but this is the one time I'm going to cheat and I'm going to make sure I do have cream in it. There you <laughs> I'm go. A Minnesota and then we girl. did the beautiful smoothie and earlier the beautiful for you. smoothie. And if you have whiskey, if you have all of that scotch oh, that you yes. spend a small fortune on, mm -hmm. you want to just taste what you spent your money on, exactly. right? Yeah. You don't want a watered down version. So I'm going to give you this. There's no. Um, oh. Black is gone. So black has sold out. I just okay. want to say uh, the copper is right behind that one in popularity. So if you want the copper that's available, there is red, blue, and purple. Another thing I want to mention while you're shopping, if you don't have the HSN charge card yet, did you hear about this deal we're doing? No. Last day, if you apply and you're approved, you can use it to save $40 oh. on a single item purchase. So now you've just dropped this down another $40. So you can get it for under $100 and on free shipping. So that's just something to keep in mind while you, you shop. You can do some damage on that. Yes. That'd be awesome. Now, the shape of this, that's very purposeful, it right? It is. There's so there's a lot of, I like to say, and, and the pun is intended, there's a lot of cool technology with this. <laughs> but I'm Not only are you able
able to choose either the, sm the large or the small ice cube for whatever you need. Remember, this is gonna be great for your smoothies. This is gonna be great for your mixed drinks. Here's where the technology comes into play. Each ice cube has this indentation. That's where the prong is used to make it, but we purposefully made it this way so you have more surface of the ice. What does that mean? It means that it's gonna cool down your drinks faster, but also because it's still that one big chunk of ice, it's gonna melt slower. Yeah. So your very expensive liqueurs, your mixed drinks, mm -hmm. all of those things you want to enjoy, they're gonna be that concentrated yeah. longer instead of a watered down version of it. You know it. what I love about this too? If you, so my aunt redid her whole kitchen. She entertains all the time. They spent so much money on the built-in ice maker that guess what? It Sometimes it breaks yes. Some, and they can't take it with them. This, because it's that beautiful sleek look, the colors are gorgeous. It's compact. You can put this out. You're going to want to have this out on your kitchen counter, at the bar, out by the pool, anywhere you can plug it into power and pour water into it. Now you're skipping out on having to add it to your kitchen and then it's stuck there. Yes. Because this you can take with you. Like we were saying, if you have parties, if you go camping, if you're tailgating on the boat, I mean, there's the sky is the limit. You can take it with you. And I think that makes this such a smart option. And it's beautiful to look at. I mean, Two of the things, I mean, it's yeah. gorgeous. They look like little bubbles on your countertop. One of my favorite things is that people come up to me and they all give me stories of how they're using their ice maker. Really? Um, I was just, we were in the, in the lobby here at HSN and somebody goes, my stepdad just had knee surgery and their refrigerator could not keep up with all the ice they oh needed gosh, for his injury. Yeah. So they said the ice maker was a savior. savior. They didn't right. have to go out and get those big bags of ice, right. find room in the freezer, have that mess everywhere. They were able to turn this on and they were able to have ice every seven minutes. It's like a game show. Which one's going to drop ice next? Seven exactly. minutes. Exactly. Do you hear that? It's so quick and I love that you, you don't have to babysit it. You don't have to do anything. No. Just when it comes into the reservoir here, you're going to want to put it somewhere cold. Exactly. <laughs> when you keep can, it. So you can see this is about full. It holds two and a half pounds. When this is full, you're going to take this ice and you're going to put it into an ice chest or any kind of a cooler, mm -hmm. then replace the tray and it will continue to make ice. I do love that peekaboo window too, because you can see how much ice is, is ready for you to use. So how do we clean this when we're ready to put it away? Let's that, say. The maintenance, there's no filters, nothing you have to do. All you have to do if at the end of the party, at the end of a get together, there's any water left over in that reservoir. You're just going to take this and place it over a sink, over the ground if you're tailgating or camping, and there's a little plug. You just pull that plug out and let the water drain out. That is all you have to that do. That is so simple. We just crossed a thousand of these sold. Everybody's jumping in because, first of all, it's just a genius idea. We always need ice, right? This is a quicker way to do it, a simpler way to do it. It's better tasting ice. You even have options on what size that you want to get. But also the fact that the value is absolutely there today. We took $30 off, free shipping and handling, as well so it makes it really simple especially if you're using a flex payment too to spend a little bit get it now and pay it off over time interest free using whatever method of payment is comfortable for you and this is the kind of thing that you can purchase and know it will get used it always, will always. All year long. exactly yeah. and not only that people actually love to gather around at me like what is this contraption yeah. <laughs> and all you do remember is just remove the tray put the water in and turn on that's all no water line no drain it is going to be making ice so you can go back and enjoy that party, enjoy the get together. Another a friend came up to me and actually said that they are replacing their filters in their fridge much less because yeah. they're not using it for their ice anymore. So that's going to save you money there as well. A lot of times you don't even know the last time you, uh, you changed that filter. I, right. Any, yeah. You see the light guessing. and you just keep, you <laughs> like, don't look at it. Hopefully this tastes good. Especially if you're at someone else's house, you have no clue what's going <laughs> right. on. Thank right. you, Rebecca. Thank this you. is Thank awesome. You. Remember, you. black is gone, but we do have the red, the copper, the blue, and the purple available for you. We're taking a quick break with some info from Juliana Rancic. Very exciting things coming. And then on the other side of that, we'll continue with our kitchen essentials. I'll see you in a few. If you want it. G by Juliana is for the confident, fashionable, amazing woman. She can expect to feel comfortable. She can also expect a lot of compliments. They'll be asking, who are you wearing? Coming up and you're looking to impress your friends, let me show you how to make this beautiful seafood boil using my DuraPan. Let's do seafood for the dinner party. Yeah. 
Yes. Our Happy Place cleaning products are made with plant-based ingredients, which means less chemicals in your house, which will make it a happy place. People think, can it work well? And it does. We chose plant-based ingredients so you're not breathing in fumes. You're not putting as many chemicals where your kids and your pets are touching them. There's a lot of great benefits to cleaning with our Happy Place products. If we can get your home clean, that's what makes your home a happy place. Are you ready? Shop like a VIP with the HSN credit card. Apply now and save up to $40 when you're approved. As an HSN card member, you'll get all kinds of perks, like extra flex on jewelry, beauty, and fashion purchases all day, every day. Plus VIP financing, VIP easy returns, exclusive offers, and there's no annual fee. Apply now. Call 1-800-695-1418 or search HSN card at hsn.com. Welcome back to Kitchen Essentials, and now we're taking the cooking outside. If you could see and smell what I am, there's nothing better than the sizzle of bacon on a griddle. Oh my goodness. And this one from Blackstone is a huge, heavy duty cooking surface you can take anywhere because it just runs on a propane tank, but you are getting 22 inches of cooking surface. So everything you're seeing here from your burgers to your fish, your steaks, maybe it's veggies, your breakfast foods, sky's the limit. Everything a grill can do and then some with even controlled heat. You've got dual heating surfaces. Uh, this is the Mama Jamma. Let me just say, you're gonna love it. And we have it back. Finally, it has been months and months since we've seen this customer pick. Over a hundred perfect five-star reviews on this beautiful, griddle and Mark Gill is here <laughs> 25 years he's been bringing us innovative kitchen items this and giving true. us cooking lessons as we go so Mark <laughs> why do we love griddle cooking so much listen this is Look at uh, this bad boy. anything anytime anywhere the Blackstone really is everything your grill can do and a thousand things it can't. And you're looking at one of the first ones here. Can you imagine a dish like this on a barbecue grill? The vegetables are all gone. And here's the biggest reason why a flat top matters so much, okay. you guys. You want to complete your outdoor kitchen and be able to make those dishes and steaks like they do at the steakhouse? That oh. is what I'm talking about. Now, I made two of these so I could do that twice because it, it, this is that special, you guys. You know how you go out and you work all year? Even even, even though we're, we're cold in parts of the country yeah, right now, course. we'll dig a trench to our barbecue and we will work our butts off for those crisscross grill lines. Guys, that's one big grill mark. All right, that's the deal with that. And here's the cool thing about this. This is 22 inches of cold rolled steel. Start thinking cast iron. And the cool thing about this, you can literally treat this grill like it owes you money. All right, there's no <laughs> rules, there's no limits. I actually had somebody come up, uh, one of the talented guys working the cameras, and uh -huh. he goes, wait a second, you can cut on this? Hold on, that you changes things, doesn't it? it? No, exactly, you guys. This is without a doubt one of those experiences in cooking that you, I, I don't know if you've been thinking about this kind of thing, if, if it's one of those types of, uh, of, 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 of oh. cooking where you've been like, man, I see this on the Food Network, so I get this uh, at diners. How can I do this myself? Well, over the course of the next few minutes, we're gonna show you diner cooking. We're gonna show you breakfast like you've never seen. I'm gonna show you some incredible ways to control what you're cooking, because not only is Blackstone giving you that surface to cook on, right. that's pure magic, yeah. which we'll get into in a little bit, but I gotta tell you something, man. Between the cleanup that. and how simple and easy it is, this is off the charts. Well, before we leave this griddle then, I'd love to know if you could tell me how we get started with it, what we sure. need, how we clean it up. Well, let's move on basics. over here because this is kind of where I, I, I set all this stuff up to kind of explain everything okay, to you, perfect. okay? Now, I said cast iron. If anybody's ever worked with cast iron, then you know that there's a seasoning process, right. all right? Well, our griddle is the same. So here's what you're gonna do, all right? You, once you get this home, you're gonna go, oh, by the way, talk about getting it home. Check out the reviews on this. Yeah. Talk about a customer 106 pick. 106 Holy moly. perfect five stars. Oh, and free shipping, by the way. So speaking That's of getting That's incredible. It it's a okay. substantial yes. piece. We'll look at that in a second. So listen, you are definitely, definitely, definitely going to want to season your grill. All right, as soon as you get it home and out of the box, I'm going to show you, and we'll show you a new one here in a second. I'm going to tell you something. It's pretty. It's so shiny and nice. <laughs> Take a picture of it because it's not going to last long. You want it to be black. So let's go ahead and get our bacon and our potatoes off of there. Now, you've got a couple of different ways 
that you can season your grill, okay? okay? You can either, whoops, and I prefer linseed. There we go, we got lots of going on here. I'm like, can I, I prefer something? linseed oil because what happens with linseed oil is as it burns off, it creates a polymer on top which gives you your non-stick. Oh. You can use any type of oil you want, however, and what some people even do is they'll use bacon grease and they'll go ahead and uh, fry up a couple of pounds of bacon and use that to season your grill. Okay. You only ever need to do it once, but here's the cool thing about this. Let's say you forget this out in the weather, mm -hmm. out in the elements. Mm -hmm. Guys, this is steel. You can always bring this back. It's such an incredible part of this. Now, when we start talking about experiences, there is nothing like that diner breakfast experience. Oh, you're not kidding. And to be able to create that at home, on the road, tailgating, camping, anywhere you like, on a Tuesday because you're bored, is such a cool thing to be able to experience in your own home, at your own campsite, right. because nothing, 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 nothing. You take it from a guy who does nothing but grill. <laughs> we, got, we got online grilling shows, we got grilling shows on TV. Take it from me, the only thing that's going to give you a diner experience is that authentic diner flat top, How you guys. Neat. Okay, so cool? you may be thinking, what are these little egg rings? Mm -hmm. Well, guess what? We have a breakfast kit. We'll always oil it your grill. It comes girl. with, it's $27, by the way. It comes with the two egg rings. Right. It comes with a bacon press and this amazing pancake batter dispenser you're about maker. to see right now. Love it, love it, love it. Wait for it. <laughs> now, Look you know, it. here's the cool thing about doing that's pancakes awesome. on your griddle. Um, no matter what cookware set you went for, no matter how how big, the 12 inch, the 14, the 16, right. no matter how talented you are, you are not gonna squeeze more than three pancakes in that silly pan. <laughs> so true. Mm. And then try to get them out of a round <laughs> you know, pan. Drive you crazy yeah. to try and but do these that. These are already ready to go. Exactly, and you can see this, guys. Now, on a normal uh, griddle surface, mm -hmm. this kind of thing turns into a nightmare because now you've got eggs that are gonna stick, you have pancakes that are gonna stick. But remember, as long as you season this grill, yeah. as long as you take that time when you get it home, two or three coats, let that burn off, okay. apply another thin coat of oil and let it burn off. I'm sense. telling you, man, it's gonna be like a skating rink. Are you seeing what I'm seeing? I don't even have the, the, the spatula under there yet and this one's already released. It's hard to believe, really. <laughs> Let's it's go ahead and take really... those off. So imagine this is you've got company over or it's just your family and you guys are all right. hanging out. You're like, I'm doing the breakfast. We're doing pancakes, eggs, bacon, hash browns. We're going to do it all on one big surface. Exactly. And you've even got dual heating here, which we'll show you in a moment, too. Exactly. So you've got, like, precise control with this thing. Well, well, that's just it. I mean, we've we've thought of everything. And actually, if you've been to the stores lately and you have a peek, Blackstone is literally taking over. Yeah. Guys, watch the air weaves this spring. Keep an eye out everywhere. Blackstone is taking over that backyard experiential grilling uh, type of cooking because you're able to do things with this grill that you can't do with other grills. The cleanup is super simple. The maintenance is practically nothing. And we created this 22 inch size originally on a, oh my goodness. All Just right, hold us, on. Right? I have a runaway pancake. I'm gonna eat you first. <laughs> I'll take care of that one if you need me to. <laughs> Here we go. Oh, one of those. So yeah, this size is not typical, especially when it first came out, it was made just for us. Right, the 22 inch is absolutely perfect because you're gonna be able to create breakfasts like that oh in minutes. So guys, you've got everything. You've got your pancakes, you've got your eggs, you've got your bacon. Are you gonna and if share? you're more of an omelet, <laughs> okay, you can have that. <laughs> I'll like drop it down on the <laughs> We ground. save it for everybody, let me tell it's you. Amazing. If you're more of an omelet person, you guys, uh -huh. here's a fun thing to do now. Always oil your griddle, okay? okay? I'm sure somebody at some point today is gonna come on with a whole bunch of great advice about light, healthy cooking. I'm not him. Okay? <laughs> <laughs> you can catch that later. Today we're gonna talk about exactly griddle cooking. This Good is like down diner home comfort style food. right here. Right. So let's go ahead and throw some veggies on there. Oh. We'll get a little bit of our wilted spinach going and a little bit of sausage. Guys, this is exactly what I did this morning. And I did it with uh, our leftover steak from last night. Nice. If, uh, if you follow our show online, you'll, you'll see what we cooked up last night. We made the best darn omelets with them today. So let's go ahead. We'll get that heating up. And by the way, this is fun cooking. This is just that cooking where you have a yeah. great time doing it. Yeah. It's a conversation piece. You're going to find the crowd out there hanging out with you. And there's only one thing to clean up afterward too, which mm -hmm. I love. Imagine trying, you usually don't even have enough eyes on the stove to do this many things at once. Exactly. Anyway. So now Look let's go you. ahead and let's create one of those omelets that okay. they're only going to make for you at a diner because okay. it's the only place where you've got that kind of equipment. And here's the other thing that's cool about this. Just like cast iron, the more you use this, 
the more family meals you make with this, the more good times you have with this, the more camping trips you have with this, the more times you have a chance to use this piece of equipment, the more it's gonna remember your family's signature, the way you love to cook, all of those tastes mm -hmm. and flavors. If you remember why you loved grandma's cast iron cooking right. when you were a kid, right. that's because those dishes and those meals just had that taste and flavor about them unlike anything else that's out there. So while that's half is cooking, I wanna remind you of something. You're on two separate burners here. So you can do different heat on each exactly. side. Exactly. We okay. could turn this up so we can create our omelet or we could, you know, keep the bacon and the potatoes warm here while it all happens. Ah. And we'll show you what the inside of the machine looks like here in a second. Okay. Well, let's go ahead and let's get This is our a massive omelet. omelet. Guys, this is what they do at the diners. This is what they do when you go out for those treats, those one-of-a-kind stops. All right, you know what? I'm not gonna it's take so the chance. It's so big, it won't It's even so fit pretty right now. Spatula. I'm just gonna do this. Okay. Look at that, I've learned in my life, if something works, just don't mess with it, Mark. Come on, knock it off. Look at that. <laughs> Look at that. Guys, that is a perfect omelet. Oh. A little bit of sauce on the top, and you have the perfect breakfast, whoop, anytime, anywhere, and that Michelle. Was so fast. This is for you, and Don't I gotta tell you, watch me cook this okay. in seconds. Really and guys, this quick. is what cooking and grilling is all about. It's what outdoor grilling is all about. And I keep saying it everything your grill can do, and a thousand things it can't. Isn't that nice? Okay, the peppers are still <laughs> crunchy. <laughs> I love it. The egg is still fluffy. And I taste every single ingredient in that. And that's exactly wow. the way that you want cooking to be. And here's what's cool about this, you guys. Omelet, so. When it comes time to clean, I gotta show you this. Even okay. though you got a big piece in there, everything just scrapes away to the back. You can get everything in that little bin that and holds it, and it everything just goes right in the garbage, guys. Easy to use, easy to clean. Once you get it seasoned, completely nonstick, you're gonna create lunch, dinner, uh, a Japanese steakhouse restaurant that you're gonna see in a second here. And when it comes time to put it away and use it again, that's it. So Isn't all that you do is hook it up up to your propane let's tank talk that about had, that right? how are we working on yeah this? let's talk about all the ways the machine works why okay. it's going to work great for you how to hook it up how to use it now this is run on propane all right mm -hmm. and now you have a choice right out of the box you're going to be able to use because we made this to be portable we want you to take this everywhere tailgating camping different spots it's around your house the garage. Driveway. <laughs> take it to the neighbor's house if they don't know how to cook right? <laughs> so this is going to run on propane now you can either stop at any store along the way to what you're going grab those little one uh like one pound ones the okay. small green ones mm -hmm. uh we give you the regulator here that goes with it all you do is you screw it on tight okay and now you're going to get a one and a half to two hour cook from one of those At little medium guys. medium to medium high with one of those little guys. Okay. So you got a couple of back-to-back -back, uh, tailgating mm -hmm. sessions. You got some great meals for the family. Yeah. This is not a slow cooker. This is your turn the heat on and get cooking bit. So that's gonna be good for a few meals. And those only sell for two or three dollars, I think. Yeah. All right, now if you want, anywhere you can get those hoses, those little, little adapter things, mm -hmm. then you can use your 20 gallon propane tank in the backyard. The average 20 gallon propane tank will give you 35 to 40 hours of cooking. Wow. Now let's talk about this surface. That is cold rolled you steel. Love, what did you say? This, treat it like it owes so you, you money. You treat this thing like it owes you money, right? <laughs> I love this that. This is the real deal. You cannot hurt the surface. This is made to live outside, work outside. If you leave it in the elements too long, it's meant to come back outside. And by the way, you say we're shipping this for you for free? Free. Watch the look on her face. She's not gonna like this. Oh go boy. ahead and hold that for Here me. Here we go. Okay. Uh-huh. I haven't now worked do out six yet curls. today. No. What? Thank Jeez, that's the real deal. That is no joke. That is no joke, guys. That's oh steel. Gosh. Now, while we have it off in here, have a look back here, okay? We didn't give you two, like, uh, the, those sticks to try and, you know, make everything hot. Mm -hmm. 300 plus square inches of cooking surface, but we want to make sure that it's evenly heated. So we gave you two separate, independently controlled, eight style full coverage burners, man. That way you can cook on one side, low on the other. You can actually see here, that's complete control over your cooking. So your cooking is perfect, your cleaning is perfect. You've got a grease trap in the the back and I'll tell you one other thing when it comes time to get this home yeah. and put it together I have bled more sworn more sworn off my family more putting a grill together <laughs> it's an awful experience it takes all day the yeah. 700 pieces right this takes minutes comes out of the box that goes on there that goes on there turn it on off you go well I if, love it. if you're just joining us i mean we haven't seen this in a long time i think we had it what was like back in september maybe right it's been a while big customer pick so uh, there's something i want to let you know there are 134 reviews on this 106 of them are perfect five star reviews wow. you love the quality the convenience how easy it is how much control you have when you use it so it's back it's here for you to experience it's 129.95 you can get it to your home for free shipping and handling mm -hmm. we're going to cover the cost of that
And we have FlexPay, so if you've never used that or it's been a while, everybody shopping can use Flex Payments. And all that means is you take this price and break it into equal monthly installments without any interest whatsoever. You can use credit, debit, PayPal, up to you. So in this case, it would be $25.99, and we send it to you right away, and now you can start using this for all of those fun family gatherings, take it with you when you go, use it out in the backyard. Right. Like Mark was saying, the options are limitless to what you can cook, how you can enjoy this, exactly. and you can really get creative, and it's stress-free. You know, it's something more fun. This gives you an opportunity for people to gather around right. and enjoy a good meal together. Exactly. You know? So guys, you're having a look at what I'm doing here. We had a whole bunch of burgers on there. If you're thinking tailgating, if you're hosting seen that big game coming this weekend let me tell you something what a machine you've got here to work with because once you start cooking you're just cooking you can clean and get going again clean and get going again so here's what we did you guys we kept one of the burgers back here a couple of them because we're going to have a, a a little bit of fun right in here with these burgers I and mean, i keep okay. talking about the fact that this is the the diner experience well guys i want you to have that authentic diner experience and however it is that you like to travel the country whether it's by boat by train but some people love love to do it from the comfort of their own house mm -hmm. with those cooking shows. Yeah. All of those great meals that are, you know, uh, uh, just kind of, you know, that part of the country, that kind of style. The type of things that people look forward to going and eating. Well, you know, if you're in Philly, you're going to have cheese steaks. If you're in California, That's you're right. going to have the burger that we're going to create here in a second. The bottom line is you are able to go ahead and run that kitchen of yours like a, like a fast food diner and this. create dishes that you've only ever seen on that treat time, you know what, or that TV show. And that's what I love about it. Love, love, love. It really does put the creativity back. And the it fun really and does. cooking. I think we got so stressed out for so long. <laughs> there's a big mess. There's lots of steps. You know, right, you got to exactly. watch things. And what order do I cook it in? I love that you have control, dual heating on this. So one side can be hot, one side can be warm, whatever you need. Yeah, I love that. Whatever you're making oh, smells more cheese? so good. Uh, hey, I ladies, do we have more cheese? cheese? I'll go on a cheese hunt for uh -oh. you. More cheese? No okay. cheese. Oh. Not if we're going to do both. We'll keep, we'll keep looking. We'll, <laughs> we'll keep, keep looking. Because this is what it. you want, that crispy cheese, exactly, right? Exactly, exactly oh, right. Delicious. I love that. Let's go ahead, and we're going to take that guy there. I'm going to snap him here. We'll oh get him gosh. going. And then, listen, like I said, have some fun with this, you guys. You know what? You want to do burgers a couple of ways? Have one with the egg on the outside, one with the egg on the inside. There's never-ending lists of the fun that you can have with this. So let's go over and check out. What heat do you have these on, by the way? What's that? What heat do you do? Do you do high, um, you know what? medium? I, I like high. Okay. I like just cooking on high, getting it over with, because I got to tell you, this kind of cooking mm -hmm. is meant to be done on high. This is usually not a low and slow. Now, okay. uh, if, if you're a fan of sunny side up eggs, that's a little bit different. Those ones, uh, you know, low and slow is a great way to go on those barbecues, okay. right? Uh, for those sunny side up. But other than that, I always recommend just cooking it on high, uh, you, you know, and just really get that high heat going for you. By the way, to our California burger, let's go ahead and oh, add my a little bit of that guy. That with sriracha <laughs> on top, and I would be a happy person for now this sure. Was, uh, this was one of my favorite dishes, you guys. Okay. That wafer thin, if you got it anywhere else, you'd actually complain about it. Thin uh, T-bone steak and eggs that you get at the diner. Uh -huh. You know what I mean, right? Uh -huh. Like you said, when those come out, uh, it's the only place where it's acceptable to have a wafer thin steak and eggs. Do you <laughs> notice the capacity of food, too, that we have? This right. is a huge surface. That's not Absolutely. typical, right? I mean, having that big You know what? That's inch. why we, we, we designed that 22 inch, you know, for our friends here at HSN, because, you know, our research shows us our people love to cook. They love to have a great time. They love to, to go ahead and invite those friends, family, get everybody over. Uh -huh. You know what? And, and, and this is that great size to do that with. So let's go ahead, you know what? Let's do this on a plate How because I'm not is. silly anymore. <laughs> so let's go ahead and get that guy, our egg. Now remember, you want to season these grills. Our grills, when we come out and we talk to you, they're brand new when we get here and we season them in the morning. So they don't have those, you know, uh, a whole bunch of cooks to get kind of uh, uh, ready for you on the fly. So right. you can even see that with this limited amount of seasoning, our burgers oh are absolutely gosh. outstanding. So guys, just like that, and it's not like we're doing, you know, a big heavy show here, but just like that, you've got that California burger with the avocado, right, that people will spend so much money for. Let's go ahead, put a pound of bacon it's on there. So right. And this is, right out of the gate, a $6.99 burger at one of those burger joints, you guys. And look at How that. How beautiful is that? Is that not the coolest? Wouldn't it be fun to do like a burger bar too? I mean, if you're already entertaining and you have all the different toppings and people can pick what they want. Right. Put them, and 
cooking burgers for a lot of people is hard because some people want medium, some want well, well that's done, where the two some want rare. That's where the cooking zones come right. into play, you guys. Now you see what we did here? Take that cheese and make it a little bigger than you think you need to because that cheese oh isn't gosh. gonna stick. So now that cheeseburger has a skirt that once you let it cool a little, you can actually bend and shape and either make it another bun, but at the bottom of the, uh, the bottom line is, that's fried cheese on a burger. Oh, you're so welcome. That right, is my dream <laughs> burger right there. If you're doing the big game this weekend, you need to serve this. I'm telling you, you guys. Oh All my right. goodness. So let's head over here. Uh, oh, by the way, um, I, I didn't share this with you either in our, in our meeting beforehand. Okay. Uh, let's flip our, uh, let's flip yeah, this, this guy, guy here. This guy is really interesting. Isn't that fun? So you just hold out the middle of the burger. Yeah, and just put an egg. egg in there. I love, love, love eggs in my burger. So now you've wow. got that perfect caramelization of the sugars and the fat. The egg is cooking perfectly that uh, the yolk's gonna be nice and protected in there. We've got our peppers that are uh, uh, going ahead and browning up there for our, our Italian sausage. But this guy here, we um, we have a big Blackstone uh, like uh, wrapped truck and uh, trailer okay. that we took out all over the country. And man, we went everywhere. We went on a ranch in Texas to do some of the best steaks you've ever seen. We were on South Street in Philly with uh, like a couple of the most famous Philly steak guys no uh, out there. We we're making Philly steaks with them. We were in the bayous of Louisiana wow. with a guy that uh, catches alligators on TV. He took us out in his boat with this exact one, the 22 inch. And guys, he takes us out, catches the alligator, does whatever he does, he does to it. And then we cook the alligator on it. Wow. It was so cool. So you talk about portability. This is like food truck diner, oh. you know, all the restaurants. And when you go to the Japanese restaurants yep. and they're flipping the eggs and there's a well, we'll reason that. that professionals like to cook this way. And now exactly. we can do it too, right? Exactly right. Guys, this is so you can have that incredible experience at home. So when the time comes for that argument, you know, the one who's got the best Philly cheesesteaks out there. Is it the guy on South street? Is it the one where it's, you know, somebody kitty corner across from the other guy? Yeah. Which one is it? You know what? We finally get to solve it. Bottom line is the best cheesesteak out there, guys, is yours because Look. you're able to do this at home on your own. So whether you like it with or without onions, uh, whether you like the processed cheese or whether you like provolone, you guys, this is wow. absolutely the way to go. So whether, like I said, whether you like going by car, boat, automobile, or you just want to experience wow. different dishes for different parts of the country in your own backyard, the Blackstone one more time. Hey, anything, anytime, anywhere. This is everything your grill can do plus a thousand things it can. I'll say this one again too. All on 22 inches of cold rolled steel that you can absolutely treat like it owes you money. You don't I have love to it. baby it at all. Not and at all. Speaking of the grill, we love our grills, of yep. course, right? But if you try to do some of these foods, they're, they're falling through. You're using foil and now you're not getting that char that you right. want, right? Exactly. You don't get du this great dual heating, this huge surface, cook everything at the same time flip it around like crazy and just enjoy that meal. That looks so good. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, if you go wow. to your state fair, you go to one of those places where this is that treat, they're gonna charge you $8.99, $9.99 for something like that. Whether it's your burger, your steak and eggs, your dogs, whether it's uh, that, that dish we showed you up top, or as we uh, go across here, some of the things that we're gonna show you right now, which I gotta tell you something, this is wow. one of the demonstrations that really got me because somebody was saying to me, you know, huge. One of the, they're huge. Yeah, yeah. Well, the capacity is, right, is incredible. But here's what I want you to think about with this, okay? Okay. All the tailgating stuff's great. You're going to have a ball with this if that's why you're grounded. But if you have or hubby or wife has that recipe that you love that stinks up the house so bad, uh -huh. right? I've always said, I don't care how good dinner is on Sunday night, by Thursday, you are over it. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> okay? that so, is the truth. So when it comes time for fish and veggies and scallops and all of those dishes that tend to linger in your house, guys, take them outside. Now all of your favorite recipes, oh you can gosh. do out there with Look none of the- crispy. You saw, mm. and, and, yeah, yeah, you go ahead and finish what you were gonna say there. Crispy skin, exactly. <laughs> that's it. Exactly, no, no, wow. no, 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 that's perfect because guys, watch what's happening here. Remember I talked about a grill that's seasoned properly? Mm -hmm. Well guys, you know what you're witnessing here? Whether the flesh side is up or whether the flesh side is down and the skin is down, that came right off the surface of the grill. I double dog dare you to go out with your regular grill and get that kind of ease yes. cooking fish. So These if, scallops are gone. So if somebody gone. is um, just tuning in and they're seeing this, you mentioned seasoning this and getting it ready for prior exactly. to first use. Yep. 
Totally. What do you do? Just put your oil on it. Oh, it's very, listen, seasoning it is very, very simple, but it's a process that's, that's very important that you really do have to do, okay? Because what ends up happening is right out of the gate, it comes as raw steel. Raw steel is not nonstick. I can, wow, that's the worst way in the world to serve that out. Holy Ooh, moly. There you go. I'm, I'm getting made fun of right now. I can, I can feel it. <laughs> it's not by me because you have cooked more than I've done in my lifetime in I love it. 20 minutes. So, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm really glad that you keep bringing up the, uh, the seasoning because, right. you know, once you get this seasoned properly, this is going to be one of your absolute favorite pieces of cookware, not only because of the taste and flavor that it gives you, not only because of the speed, not only because of the versatility, not only because you can literally cook anything, anytime, anywhere, but when it comes time to that cleanup, it's out of this world. And when you want taste, when it comes down to taste alone, you are never going to match anything, especially when you can grill lemon for your fish. That is beautiful. <laughs> I mean, and here's what I love too. One twenty nine ninety five, right? You're co you're creating an outdoor kitchen. Yep. I mean, if you've got even if you don't have one, but if you've got a backyard or a pool area, you add this, and now it's complete. Because like Mark's saying, everything your grill can do, and then some. I mean, exactly. honestly, the, and. It's so great because it's free shipping right now. The reviews are phenomenal. Please go read them. World. See what people love about this griddle. Um, and you can get it home with free shipping on a flex payment of $25.99. And then on top of that, if you don't have the HSN charge card, go ahead and apply for that because at the time of approval, you can actually take $40 off a single item purchase. So now you're getting this home for $90. Dollars. That's I incredible. mean, and this is something that you will use all the time. It's, it's exactly. fun. This has been so fun watching you create you know, all of these different meals. And that's what it is. And, and that's the cool thing when you have a piece of equipment like this. Listen, the dishes that I'm doing aren't hard. Think about it. I've done a couple of sandwiches, what is, uh, equates to a hot dog. And I right. put a couple of slabs of meat on steel. At the end of the day, you know, though, you guys, it's all about the equipment that you have, the way it handles your food, and more importantly, the way it holds on to those tastes and flavors. And, you know, and I've said this a whole bunch of times. It all comes down to a grill that's simple to use, tough as nails, and gives you the opportunity to do things on your grill that you can't do on normal grills. Just like what you're about to see here. Oh boy. If you've ever spent a fortune on one of those uh, Japanese restaurants, yep. well, listen, you guys, you can oh. go ahead and do that at 100 bucks wow. a crack, or you can do it yourself on your grill, in your backyard, at your campsite, at the tailgate, in the garage, at the neighbor's house. You can do it with the one pound propane tank, the 20 pound propane tank, yep. and it's all happening on a surface that I keep saying, watch this, Treat it like it owes you money. <laughs> this is the real deal, you guys. Just remind me to always pay you back. Can we just say, because, I, I don't know, it. Mark Gill with a knife, I don't know if I'd want to mess with that. That is a beautiful meal you just created. Nice? And nice, you, you didn't guys? have to add a ton. You know, not you do all. simple seasoning because you really are tasting the food and that char. There's nothing better than that charred flavor. Would exactly. you, I mean, do you think people used to shy away from this kind of thing with steaks because right. they thought the grill was the only way to do it? Right. Exactly. Yeah. Well, look at this dish, you guys, and think about what we've made today. You are not going to do this on your grill. You are not going to do that breakfast on your grill. You're not going to do those Philly cheesesteaks on your grill. You're not going to do that fish on your grill. You're not going to do that scallops on your grill. Guys, this is everything your grill can do. Burgers, hot dogs, kebabs, chicken. Wow. And I mean, like I keep saying, a thousand things that your grill can't do. So, Michelle, I'm just going to go ahead and I'm going to get the last little bit there. I'm going to put those two or three pieces of onion on the floor like I like to do. <laughs> and I'm going to set this over here. speaking to me. Look at that. And let me just walk you guys. Let me just take you down for a second, okay? okay. Remember what we did here. We've got our full breakfast start to finish that we did when we opened the show up, okay? We've got our omelet that was out of this world that you saw us make start to finish in a matter of seconds. We've got the fish skin side up, skin side down with grilled lemon, scallops, and asparagus that isn't gonna smell up the house. We did our Japanese steakhouse meal. We lit the onions on fire and everything. Beautiful. Made everybody in the building nuts. <laughs> Love it. <laughs> a pile of burgers, you guys, 300 plus square inches of cooking space. This is huge. Beautiful dual burners, as you got the options with the uh, uh, propane, and then when it comes time to just those everyday treats that are now something you can do on Tuesday faster than easier than anything in the kitchen. The, the, the California burger with that perfect bacon and the avocado, the, the, the cheese skirt, are you kidding me with that? that <laughs> burger, the Italian sausage, the Philly cheese steaks, the sky's the limit, you guys. Anything, anytime, anywhere, you're gonna love it.
I love it. You did. Bravo. You got every <laughs> camera person drooling at this point. No, I'm just kidding, but I, I might be just a little bit. I am. I'll just tell you think what, about this it. Stuff. This is so great. It's a really nice way to branch out, get creative. That's what cooking's meant to be. That's what have it's all some about. fun, get everybody together. It's a great time to pick it up while we have it on free shipping. And we have five flex payments available. And don't forget, if you don't have the HSN card and you apply for that, once you're approved, you can use it to take another $40 off of this. Exactly. You have worked so hard. I think you, you deserve to Along enjoy the fruits of your labor no, for clean. sure. You know, no, it's quick cleanup at least. <laughs> so there's that. <laughs> Thank you so much, Mark. Thank you. Uh, you know, if you need great drinks to go along with this, you gotta have the ice, right? So if you missed it earlier in the hour, we had the amazing ice maker from Improvements. This is the compact version. So it's actually the smallest footprint at 12 and three quarter inches high, the lightest weight version, but still the same capacity. 26 pounds of ice you can turn out in a 24 hour period. So every seven minutes, you get fresh, wonderful tasting ice. We have have it right now for $30 off. It's on free shipping and handling and five flex payments. You don't need a water line. Plug it into the power outlet, add your water, and you're good to go. So if you want to get that, we do still have some colors available for you. There's purple, blue, copper, and red. So enjoy that. Enjoy the rest of your day. I'll be back tomorrow for Lunch Rush at 12 p.m. Eastern. And now you get to do some shopping with the wonderful Carrie Smith. So I will see you guys tomorrow. Have a great Monday, everybody. Thanks, Michelle. Hi, everybody. My name is Carrie Smith, and this hour, I don't even know what to call this hour. It's great. We're calling it organization, but the first item that I have for you is one of my favorite items, and it's the silliest little thing, but I tell you what, for all of us girls and guys that love our shoes, that hate nothing more than when you put your shoes on and they're pinching that one spot on the side or your feet have expanded and they just don't fit as